Hey guys, what's up? My name's Sam. I'm 23 years old uh, from Vancouver, BC, and I did apply for Global Degree, uh, the Southeast Asia leg of the tour last year. Uh, this is my second time applying, and here's why you should choose me this time. Since I last applied uh, to Global Degree, I actually went to India for six weeks. Um, went to the International Yoga Festival in Rishikesh, which was unbelievable and humbling, and I just learned so much from so many different uh, different teachers, different styles. It was uh, enlightening to say the least. Um, and then I spent about two weeks teaching English to Buddhist monks in a Tibetan refugee uh, village up north in India, which was probably one of the hardest things I've ever done, but nonetheless a uh, great learning curve. I actually just graduated uh, my undergrad degree, and I know in my last video I talked a lot about um, how we feel the need to live a domesticated lifestyle and kind of go through the motions of like going through school, graduating, getting a job, getting married, having kids, and dying. And um, I have to say that really makes me nervous, that really makes me um, uneasy, that's not the type of life I want to live at all. Um, I think I've done a pretty good job thus far of maintaining an exciting life and kind of doing things that scare the absolute shit out of me. Um, but that's why my life has been exciting and that's why I have accomplished so much. I'm only 23 and I've traveled throughout Southeast Asia and Europe and India and um, I know it's not going to end anytime soon. Um, I am absolutely stoked that you guys are deciding to do Europe as the next leg of your global degree tour. Um, Europe has a, has a very special place in my heart. It is where I first traveled um, kind of on my own when I was 19. Um, I spent three months there traveling to, uh, throughout 12 different countries um, and it really, although I just scratched the surface, um, it really opened my eyes up to how amazing travel is. I could write a book about all the things that I love about traveling, um, but one of, the, one of the greatest things is the genuine conversations that you have with people and um, the fact that you can sit down next to a stranger and have a conversation and not know their name or where they're from or where they're going and just talk and be in that moment. Another thing that I love about traveling is the great community of people that um, it attracts. You guys obviously seem pretty all right. You seem all right. <laughs> um, no, you guys are awesome. Um, and you just have a passion for living life and we all share that and feed off that energy with one another. Um, it's really, really amazing to be a part of something bigger than yourself. Traveling has made me think twice about the person that I want to be and the way I want to impact others as well. One of my greatest aspirations um, in this lifetime is to inspire others to live their life to the fullest and um, make them realize that you do have control over your own happiness. Um, and now that I've found that I what I want to do and what makes me happy I am going full force into it like I am not stopping anytime soon and I think that's an amazing thing a lot of people don't accomplish that in their entire life they're still searching for this happiness or what what drives them what makes them want to live life to the fullest and I think that you guys have an unbelievable global movement going on right now with this global degree project um, and I'd be humbled to be a part of it and I really want to bring something to the project and inspire others and write about it. I love to blog, um, share my photos, and be a part of something bigger than myself. 